Uh, hello guys, I want to do a review or first impressions or kind of a review of these um, binoculars that I just got. Um, they're the Nikon Aculon um, A211, 211. Um, that's what the cap's on. And I, I'm not really experienced with um, binoculars. Basically what happened was um, about a few days ago I went to this thing where we were going to see um, Jupiter and Saturn conjunction. It's like they're in space close to each other. And um, the, one of the guys from the astronomy club said a good way to get into astronomy like is just to go get yourself a pair of binoculars, um, like a decent pair, like maybe about two hundred dollars Australian. And um, yeah, like, and then so it kind of was in my head, and I was like, oh okay, maybe. And so uh, today was Boxing Day, and um, I went down to Chatty and I bought a pair from JB Hi-Fi. So it was on sale, so it was like 165 I think it was, or something like that, from 200 And um, like I did the unboxing before and I like was in love with it. But today, after dinner, um, I took these out and they're really comfy. Like um, I just wore them with the strap that comes with it. Went to like a just very close by Pool Park and looked around. And once, like, I, and I also I watched a video from Nikon Canada about how to adjust them. It was pretty simple, like turning this and then turning this knob to make with focus in your eyes and then getting the right distance and stuff um and then after that it was i was like fed it was fantastic um it's i can basically say in the review if you want to get these apparently these are good all-rounders so they're probably good for whatever purpose you want like looking at birds or animals or um for me it was mainly to look at the stars because like i like to look at you know how they have those events like meteor showers and stuff um I like to go out and have a look, but I thought, oh, um, if I have these binoculars, it might look even better, and um, I, it does. So basically, I went outside and I, I walked and um, I looked at the moon, and through these, the moon looks amazing. Like I've never seen the moon look like that before. Like it looks so clear and like big, and I could see all the craters on the like the the texture of the moon, and it felt like I was so close I could just touch it, even though it's like thousands of kilometers away i'm not sure yeah i'm sure it's thousands at least thousands um and then i could see um jupiter and saturn um through these as well because of the binoculars they, i think they pick up more light so it's easier to see things and they look closer and i'm in love with these they feel good and um so um i don't know what else to say like i don't have a lot of experience with binoculars but i can say that if you're curious about getting these for looking at the stars i think they're great i mean yeah, I reckon they're really good for... I really don't know. I mean, I'm, I'm sure if you bought different... There's so many different types. But basically, I'll keep it short saying I love them. They feel great. They look great and um, when you look at things. And I have no complaints after using just one time. So that's more of the first impressions anyway. But um, it's really cool. It's like it's got like an adjustable thing like very easily to do. So if you wear glasses or not, like I think if you don't wear glasses, you have it like that. And if you wear glasses, you just uh, make it closer. So that it's the right distance for the focusing part and stuff. Um, so I don't know what else to say about it except uh, it's not waterproof. It says in the instructions, but um, I don't know that's fine. I mean, I think I guess if you pay more, you might be able to get like waterproof ones. But I don't think I'll be using it in the rain. I guess so. I can always put it away if it's raining. <laughs> but anyway, just for a basic pair that um I can just pull out when there's something to look out. Like you know, every now and then there'll be some event that my friends tell me about like the moon or some meteor showers you know um so i'll keep it short now <laughs> i don't know what to say spec wise but it's a yeah so it's 10 times 50 so it magnifies by 10 times by 10 and 50 is the distance of about 50 millimeters and uh, the wider it is the more light it allows so i did a little bit of research <laughs> but yeah it's cool it's like it's got it comes with a strap and the strap has this thing that connects to the cap here like that to protect it and then these bits here can attach to that so i actually had to watch a video how to attach the strap on but it was like uh, some guy on youtube showed how to do it but um yeah i'll keep it short basically i love them that's my impression of them and my review of it is i love them for stargazing and it's so fun like i just the, the peaceful uh, i've got a video of, oh no nah, can't really see like i held up my camera to look through it but it doesn't do it justice really but you just have to trust me that when you look through it, it looks really nice. Okay, I'll keep it short. And um, that's the review. See you guys. Bye.